in addition to making videos, we also have something at Adobe that we have to use to help kind of turn our customers' prospects mm -hmm. into purchasers and then the, turn those purchasers into loyal customers. We do that through something we call a journey. The problem with journeys is you never quite know how well they're going to perform. Are they going to do great? Are you going to have lots of new customers or just a few? Mm -hmm. So Nakash, in collaboration with our AI and machine learning services team, has built a solution to this problem. Nikash, take it away, buddy. Ooh. So, um, so Tig, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm a, I'm a huge gym buff. <laughs> no. <laughs> I thought so. <laughs> uh, and, and this is largely due to the great engagement that the fitness brand I subscribe to has with me. Are there any brands that are really good at communicating with you? Any, any brands? Like coffee shops, hotels, yeah. that really you know, have good conversations with you. Coffee <laughs> shops or hotels? Yeah, you know, like any brands that just knows TIG. I, I don't know. Um, uh, Alfred Coffee? Yeah. Oh, yeah, coffee. that works, that works. Everybody's favorite. Sure. Yeah. Let's, let's go with that. <laughs> that. So I'd like, to, I'd like to show you how we can use um, Adobe's products to create such an engaging experience. Yeah. And even use artificial intelligence to predict how the experience will perform before launch. Great. So we have a product, we have a product called Journey Optimizer which can be used to create such experiences through something we call journeys. So I'm going to launch into the product right here. Perfect. Now I'm targeting gym members. So I'm just going to create a journey for them. Mm -hmm. Now my frequent gym members, I'm going to send them a push notification to keep going, just to keep up the spirit. That's a good idea. It is, right? <laughs> and... Uh, Click on that. For my intro... <laughs> <laughs> what? I know how this works. Yeah. 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 Uh, it's all that coffee. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> Decaf, actually. <laughs> but uh, anyway, what were we doing here? Yeah. <laughs> so for my infrequent customers, if they are app users, I'm going to send them a special fitness promotion as a push notification. And for my non-app users, I'm going to send them an email to try out some new equipment. Because, you know, who doesn't like to go to the gym and try out some new equipment, right? Of course, of course. <laughs> so this looks good. We've yeah. got it set up. And do you think we're ready to launch this journey? What's it? Do I think? Yeah, do <laughs> you Well, yeah. OK, all right. I you think it's here. obvious. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you clicked on those things, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, I, I, I like the measured opinion, yeah. Uh, but how do we know how users are actually going to engage with this journey? I mean, how can we be sure? Tig, would you be impressed if I could um, predict the future? Well, yeah. Yeah, me too, actually. Yeah. Yes. yeah. Is there anyone here that would be like, meh? Meh. <laughs> What's the future? I can't predict everything, but I can predict the future for this journey, and that's thanks to Project Pathwise. So Project Pathwise adds a simulation option right here, and when I click on Simulate, Pathwise is using millions of data points from past journeys to magically evaluate how users are going to flow through this journey before launch. Wow. All right. Yes. It's pretty awesome. We love that, it's pretty right? Pretty awesome. Yeah. <laughs> this is the stuff we're here for. Yeah. <laughs> and there's a lot going on on the screen, so let me walk through it. On the left, Pathwise is telling me that the journey will have a 3% lift for my LTV for my gym members, which is not bad. Yeah. On the right, it tells me that 1.2 million users are going to enter this journey, and it shows me their distribution by profile. For example, it shows me that about 60% We'll take membership in January, which makes sense, I guess. It's a gym. Yeah. You feel optimistic at the beginning of a year. 
<laughs> and I can also dig in into a branch. So let's see what my infrequent customers look like by clicking here. Perfect. So now I can see 428,000 users are going to go in here. And about 28% are from New York. So it's a, it's a lot of bagels and pizzas, I guess. Yeah. Keeping people away from the show. <laughs> Just a guess. Um, I can also see how my email is going to perform. So I click on my email right here. So Perfect. you can't you can't predict like anything. It's like specific to this. <laughs> yeah. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay. It's too bad. Yeah. Because I have some questions for you, but. <laughs> So Pathwise thinks that uh, the email is going to get an open rate of 5.1% and a click-through rate of 0.1%, which is not bad, but maybe we can do better. I think we can. We can. <laughs> Pathwise agrees with you. Um, while analyzing the journey, Pathwise has automatically found actionable ways to improve the journey, and that's the blue dots right here. Right. So let's click on one of these glowing things. That one's good. That one's cool, right? Perfect. So Pathwise is giving me two actionable ways to improve my journey. The first is to add a condition for 20 to 25-year-olds, 21 to 25-year-olds. I tell them about new equipment. And it's saying that that will have a 6% lift instead of the 3%. And the second is to add a condition for 18 to 35-year-olds and tell them about the introduction of Zumba classes. I mean, who doesn't like Zumba? <laughs> I don't know a person. I don't, <laughs> not a soul. <laughs> right? So what, what do you think, Tig? Which one seems better to you? Zumba? Let's go Zumba. Yeah, let's go Zumba. Yeah. OK, cool. You asked for it. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to apply this recommendation. Pathwise is creating a copy of the journey. It's rerunning the simulation. And perfect. It's done. It shows it's created the new journey. On the left, I can see now that the estimated lift is 5% instead of 3%. And just for my reference, I can go back to the old one. I can see how things are looking. I can explore some other suggestions if I wanted to. And I could come back here. And when I'm ready, I can hit Publish, and I'm good to go. And all of this in a matter of minutes. So with Pathwise, you can create and test marketing journeys with ease. So we have more time to, you know, hit the gym. Yeah, of course. <laughs> or eat bagels. Ooh. Which sounds like a better option. Yes. <laughs> uh, if you'd like to see this added to product, please tweet hashtag project uh, pathwise. Thank you so much. Woo. All right. Unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs>